Okay, this, uh, if you're watching from the video gallery, this movie is on um, how to collect um, client and firm information uh, using, uh, using a form. The form is from Google Docs, and you're going to love how easy this is to do. It's my Google Docs account, um, and uh, the way I use it often is to, um, things I'm going to publish online, I uh, use Google Docs to uh, take care of. Anyway, you sign into the Google Docs account, which of course you have if you have Google Apps or if you use um, any Google account that comes with it. You just go to New, go to Form, and then there it is. It's pretty self-explanatory. Just fill in this information here um, and decide whether you want what type of question you want. Uh, paragraph text, multiple choice check boxes, choose from the list, put in a help text if you want it and whether or not you want it um, required, click done, and then that's it. The next one you see when you roll over it, it gives you the options here. If I want to edit this one, I click edit, fill in the information. Now if I want to do, if I want to throw it away, just press the little trash can. Now what I'm going to do here on this is, um, this is Firefox for the Mac. I'm going to minimize that. I, don't, I often do that. I'm going to click that little oval there to uh, free up some space. Now the, um, what makes it nice is that right now it's just a plain form. The theme is plain. Click, click the theme to um, change what it looks like. Uh, there are 69 of them. Um, I think I, I, um, the form I have posted is in the elegant theme, which is easy. You just pick one and then look, see what it looks like. Okay, well, we'll use this one. Then you go back and you finish off your form. Now you can, once you get done with it, you email it. You can email this form to someone um, so they can fill it out and the information will come right back to you, which leads me to the second part, which is where does the information go? The information goes right here. Um, this is the one I, I posted. And the information goes right here into a spreadsheet, which is part of Google Docs. Now, this information will come right in. And one thing I want, um, want you to show about, it automatically fills these things out for it. just creates itself. And all your responses from the form will come right here. Uh, what I want to show you about that is the Share button. And go to Set Notification Rules. And with that, you can... Right now I have this one set, so whenever some any changes are made, I get an email right away, and that's probably what you're going to want to do. So you can so you can just get these things out there, and when something happens, the uh, the machine will let you know. And that's basically all there is to it. You can embed the form from form, you can edit the form from form, you can delete it, and you can send it from here as well. So this is um, so these things have uh, enduring value. Now the number of uses for these, use them externally um, to collect information from clients or uh, or as contact boxes to your website. Really, whatever you whatever you want to do, um, there are, I give you a few uh, recommendations on the thing, and if uh, and I hope they help and they're really easy to use. And you can Google Apps is one of the really helpful. Um, things and it's it, uh you can do a lot more than probably you think you can so uh have fun and if you have any questions please uh don't be shy and uh, let me know